Let's see it. All right. Come Let's in. see it. I, I actually got to stand up for this. Hold up, man, because I, I want to tell you right now. All right. Oh, we got Larry Lur. This is Larry. Larry Lur. Pretty casual. I'm like, <laughs> I'm actually digging the Nikes. I'm Larry has always been a Nikes kind of guy. Interesting choice. A very blue palette overall. Got the great pants. But the red shoes will help bring it out. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, right, Nate? Larry has always been a Nikes kind of guy. And I like that about Larry. Always, always wearing Nikes. All right, coming up next, representing the Street Fighter Five community here. We know him all in well, Uncle Valle. And I'm, I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm I'm digging this like, this like I, I'm I, I'm kind I'm not retired, but you know I'm, I'm I still got it. Valle has got Valle's got, need, Valle got needs the, a vacation at this he, point. Yes. And that's exactly yeah, what he's he going does. for. He's, yeah, he does. work out. I like that the little blue and then the palm trees have a little bit of red tint on them, so the yes. yellow brings it out on the pants. Yeah. And then he's got a gray neutral. Summertime Valle. Shoe. Summertime Valle. That's yeah. the skin. Mm -hmm. That's the skin. All, All right, right, coming up next to the stream, bro, it is Luco representing the Smash community. And I'm not going to lie, I like this classy yet casual style he's going on from the chain. That's where my eyes are at. I, I like the chain, how he's got down the shoes. Yeah. Down to the shoes, man. Mm -hmm. I do like also that he has the blue jeans, but also he doesn't. he's not wearing socks. He allows his skin tone to come exactly. through and match with the brown and the sure. brown that he has on the shoes and on the really shirt as well. Really good touch. Yeah, very nice. I hope you guys don't think we're... Pulling anything out of our no, out of I'm, butts. I'm I, ho I hope we're giving good <laughs> analy analysis on our commentary here. And of here. course, I love this look, man. I feel like I'm back at watch at home watching an episode of The Office here. The white, the the white look, it fits him, man. It yeah. fits him. I I like I like the use of casual Nikes as a shoe. I'm a Nike fan. It's a Stephen King. It's a yeah. Stephen King look. Yeah. Stephen King look. <laughs> That's exactly what it's probably I was thinking going Dwight for. from The Office, man. <laughs> Sit if you're out there. I'm finally watching The Office. But yeah. coming up next here is Palka, top three in his PR region, of course. I like this look. It seems to fit him well. Oh, he's got the hoodie. And he's got the – oh, there it is, man. He looks at the crowd, and he calls it out. Under this Armour shoes, a very interesting choice. Going with a very brown palette, actually. Mm -hmm. And he's got the white design on the graphic shirt underneath just to be able to help – bring out some color into the outfit. I, I like the use of the Under Armour shoes because you know what this is? This is streetwear. I'm out on the streets. I'm out there on my way to my Smash tournament. I don't want to look like I just woke up out of bed. You know, just a little bit of style. A little bit of style. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And of course, the Street Fighter V community hats next represented. I am actually digging this shirt, man. I, I actually, this is not going to work with me. But I, I'm actually digging this shirt. The single stripe on the red, I yeah. like it. And it matches the, oh, he's got the red socks. Yeah, and that's, what I'm, yeah, this is that's a very, what I'm saying. Yeah, it's a very consistent color palette throughout. He's got the reds and the blues. And he's got that little burgundy to be able to tone it down a bit on the pants area. All right, coming up next here from the Street Fighter. I'm sorry, from the Smash community here. Man, the man with the beats, the man with the most. Always got the hat looked down, man. Of course, it is Rod. And I'm, dig I'm digging the look. Rod's outfit is one of my favorites, actually, from what I saw. He's already got the hat. That was that oh, was not, that was okay. not part that was not part of the outfit. The hat was already Rod's. But, but I, then you know the, what he it, made it part of. Accentuating it with yeah. the floral design and the stripe L vertical. L oh, okay. I really like the vertical stripes as well. Vertical. Oh, Jinzen, thank you for the ten dollars donation. But yeah, the vertical stripes help complement Rod's uh, height. And, that's what I'm saying. Rod is a very tall man. Yeah. And he's got the height, and he rocks it well, man. He yeah, rocks it, it well. helps complement it. So. Yeah. All right, coming up next on the stream, of course, the branch between both Ajax. Coming up next, I am liking, I'm kind of liking this look, man. I'm not going to lie, I'm a fan of the green. And you seem to be wearing green as well. And Ajax coming in with the casual look, a little bit more baggy. But you know what I'm liking? I'm liking the Jordans. Look at the Jordans, man. What is he doing? Oh, he's oh. The, flex. the flex. Yeah, just showing off the guns, man. You got that camo color, reminds you of the military. And, of course, the gray underneath. You just know what? It's fitting a theme. The, the best part about it is that sometimes you work too much camo. It's a little tacky, and it actually works well. It, it works well. All right, coming up next here, Commander Jesse, another Street Fighter representative. This man looking fresh. You know why? Because look, look at this. Look at this. Look at that. The blazer, the color of shirt, and the shoes, ladies and gentlemen. This is best dressed street. This this is esports, man. This yeah. is esports look. That's very nice. It has the, there's a single red stripe on exactly. the on the shirt that mm -hmm. helps bring out the blue on the blazer as exactly. well. Exactly. And of course, he doesn't have it open because he's or he has the blazer open because he's trying to keep it casual. Very nice stuff. All right, coming 
Come, I'm telling you, man, he looks like he works at the IT, but don't let him fool you, man. He's actually well dressed, the best dressed Pikachu man out here, of course. Esam. I think the the designer might have picked the red flannel also because <laughs> because his glasses have that little red, red rim underneath. Yeah, I was yeah. gonna say. Mm -hmm. And then and keep the white shirt has a little design, black pants or the grayish pants. Yeah, very yeah. nice look. I like it. I, I like. I think the shoes too, very comfortable. This is street. This is you're on the street, man. You're out there enjoying yourself. And of course, coming up next, man, the man, the myth, the legend, the voice of Street Fighter himself. Make no introduction any further. It is James Chen out here. I am digging the flannel, man. The little flannel just tied around the waist. He's got the jean shorts rolled up. They call him shorts. And the tie-dye is a very neutral color underneath and then yeah. just has the tie-dye shirt to bring out the color in his face as well. And of course, the, man, the, the woman of the hour, the, the, the most dressed, of course. Look at, look at this, it's stunning, stunning. This okay, uh, Sen Senpai legit used to be a model. So yeah, I, like, I was gonna this, say, is, this she, is completely she has an edge. this is she completely has an for edge. her. Yeah, yeah, this is completely all her. Yeah, very this nice. Is all, this is all her. Very nice dress, just great presentation overall for her. Yeah. And she's got the pink she has the pink hair to be yeah. able to bring out the color the, more. Exactly. Because she's got a gray shirt exactly. and the, or gray dress, excuse me, and the, the black tights, so very nice presentation the, from Simpai. The, the, mon the monochrome color really brings out her pink hair. Yeah, nice. and I'm, and sure, like I'm sure the designer picked that out yeah. specifically for that. I the, like how these designers picked out stuff that, that helps insinuate yeah. certain like skin tone characteristics or just accessories that they already own, like the hat, the glasses, the pink hair, yeah. all that stuff. And of course, the uh, the, the choker as well that Simpai is wearing was very yeah. nice. Has a little bell too, I think. And yeah, very, so, so very the, great outfit. So overall. the best part about being on our side here is we got another look at him, right? So I'm gonna come back back here. We're gonna see all of our picks. I got my choice for best dressed easily uh, from each side of the community, and my personal favorite. I I, <laughs> I hope and I hope you do too, because they're, they're all great looks. They're all great looks. And you know what? And if Goodwill does end up selling these looks at their thrift stores, that's a steal, dude. Yeah. There's, there's a reason why people love going to Goodwill. Senpai is uh, coming right back here. Senpai? For me, Senpai is first place. Like, yeah, without oh. a doubt. Oh, and the white shoes too. They're so beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful outfit. Yeah, really, really good. Senpai, uh, my first place taker of the Smash community here. Uh, Street Fighter community, first place, Commander Jesse. Commander Jesse. For Commander me Jesse as well. is so yeah. good. Mm -hmm. uh, my personal favorite right here going to be coming out in the middle. Uh, Alex Vaya's look. I, I'm digging it. I'm yeah. digging it. This, this is a look for him. I think just overall, though, I think Rod is a very close contender as well. I yeah. think Senpai just brings herself naturally much more. Yeah. But part of it also is with the experience that she has as a model yeah. before she joins the staff. Exactly. Smash Her community. original name, Cinnamon. It is Cinnamon. Yeah. So, of course, uh, I enjoy it, man. My, 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 t my bet to take it, hard tie between Commander Jesse mm -hmm. and Senpai. Yeah. Hard, hard, hard tie. Yeah, so very nice outfits all around. I really enjoy it. And, uh, yeah, thanks, guys, for uh, sticking around, listening us to our commentary mm -hmm. here at the and fashion show. Of course, our hidden mentions are going to be Rod and Alex Fire. He just, Alex Vaya just rocks this look. Yeah, I mean, it's funny, too, because Vaya is pretty tall already. Yeah. And then Rod is just, like, towering over <laughs> Vaya. <laughs> right. and, and, and the best part about Vaya is he rocks this look because of his age. You know? Yeah. He did. <laughs> He's uh, definitely one of the older members of our community. Hope you guys enjoyed the fashion show. That was actually a very nice presentation. Yeah. And I, I really like what the, the designer had going for them. So Yeah, I really did. Nice Able to bring out not only their age as a tool, but the way that they already are. I really like how she was able to compliment Rod's hat. Mm -hmm. and like, that's that's a signature Rod thing. The beads, Rod wasn't able to rock them with this actual look, right? It's a classic.